anyone that anyone that um, has give people a platform to damage me in the last two years, yeah, I will terrible. never interact with them yeah. ever, and that's why you don't see me engaging with the podcasters the because they get they're given platforms to liars, and the, when they're given platforms to these liars, yeah. it, it, people call me a liar. But every podcast I've done, I've done nothing but spoke the fucking truth. Yeah. And I've got a story to back it. Yeah. And there's, there's enough evidence to back my story there. Yeah. When you're given a platform to a complete liar, mm. and you know you're given this platform to that complete liar, mm. you're a piece of shit. Yeah. You're not only a piece of shit, you're damaging the podcasting infrastructure. Mm. We, we, we want podcasting to be true, yes. real. We want it to be truthful and everyone's looking into to hear truthful stories. We don't want to saturate it with dickheads who haven't got a story, but they're inventing one just so they get clickbait. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what's happened to me. I've just had a load of little vultures jumping on, chatting poo about me. Yeah. I haven't had the time to defend myself. I really didn't want to defend myself. Yeah. You know what I mean? yeah. Most of the times I've left it. Now I'm starting to turn the heat up on them yeah. because these individuals that are targeting me, they're targeting me when they've been out on the Friday night on the coke mm. and they sat there of a weekend smashed up off drugs and drink and then yeah. they target me yeah. 